is having a party, his daughter is getting married. Wait, we've got humanitarian cargoes. I've spent a lot of time getting all the paperwork here. Not raise your voice at me. I'm sorry. I promise to deliver your stuff, and Thank I you. will. You should be thanking me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. General, sir. We'll be overweight with the SUVs. They will be within the limits. Listen up. Tomorrow we need to be at the house of the newlyweds with these cars. Shining like boots on parade. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I'm sorry. Can you deliver this, please? There's a boy in the orphanage, Daniel. He's waiting for it. Okay. The man who's meeting you knows. Will you deliver it? Okay, sure. Thank you so much. Happened. Was it vodka? Tell me, why do you care so much? I don't care. McCoy, don't forget to return your key for the room. So what? Makes no difference. Better to be rational. You understand? There are rules. They ask you to turn, turn. They ask you to close your eyes, close them. People will do their own business and then they'll help you. To hell with such rules. And where does that get you? All the money we could have been paid. Now you can't even fly a crop duster. You're blacklisted. Are you trying to make me feel worse? Cheers. Look. You're a great pilot. You can't live without flying. You'd die. I know you. Everything's fine. Why are you so stubborn? Go and speak with your father. Ask him to help you. Having your father, how did you manage to be in such a hole? Well, let's hope he helps you. I say it again, I won't ask him. Why? Because of pride? He won't help. He's not gonna like this. What will you do? I haven't decided. Alex, I know they wanted to fire me too. Thank you for taking over. Forget it. Please go to Moscow. Talk to your father. No.
книжка движется. Нормально. А чего не на компьютере? Там стирать можно. Стирать это для тех, у кого мозги на бекрень. Записки последнего авиаконструктора. Ух ты, классное название. Пап, я ненадолго. Работу найду, комнату сниму или еще что-нибудь придумаю. Какую-то работу найдешь. Мало ли. Знаешь, как я картошку умею чистить? С неба в кухарке. Пап, я... Ненарочно. Из погранцов выгнали ненарочно. Из ВВС тоже. Сейчас с грузовой машины сняли. Опять ненарочно, да? Товарищ большой начальник самой молодой авиакомпании страны? Здравия желаю. Гущина то Слушай-ка, э, летчиков у вас сейчас набирают? Интересуется тут один товарищ. Родственник дальний. Тут у него с характеристиками беда. Посмотрите его. Конечно, на общих основаниях такой же. Ну хорошо. Если что не так, гоните его в шею. А меня, в случае чего, зовите. Я еще жив. Ну хорошо, есть. Все, дальше сам. Авиакомпания хоть и маленькая, но надежная. Экзамен в аэропорту в тренажерном центре. Там все наши авиакомпании тренируются. Так что, если опозоришься, то перед всем миром. Пап, спасибо. Сейчас-то хоть. Постараюсь без своих завиральных идей. А? Деньги-то у тебя есть? Да, есть. Вон там в тумбочке возьми. И ключи. I wrote a report that mentions you cannot work as a pilot for our airline. I'm not competent to work in your company. You're the one who has it all figured out here. This one doesn't I'm fit. I'm sorry. This one either. Are you the only pilot here? None of your trainees become pilots. Sorry. Perhaps this is because of you. Perhaps it is. Perhaps I should be the one to not allow unbalanced and unattentive people to fly planes. And this is what I do. Goodbye. Sorry, I, I got lost. Are you going to say that to the passengers? Where's your paperwork? Why is your CV so bad? Okay, get into the simulator. Standard takeoff, weather is good. Gears up. Flaps, position. That was good. Michael, add some clouds and moderate turbulence. Approaching to desired altitude. You should take echelon 160. It will be better there. Did you hear me? I hear you. I prefer my way. He's flying over. Nice. 
Michael, please. Let's add a bit more. And right engine. Power in the engine. Coming in for landing. At the nearest airport. Michael. Minus five degrees C, runway 18. Tailwind. Leonard. That's too much. Break. 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 The runway's too short. Break. So what? He touched down. I look at the facts. A military pilot crashed the plane. Anything else? He was doing great. You failed him on purpose because you hate it when someone does things differently. Pilot Grandes? Yep. Pilot Bedford? Yes. Pilot Saunders? Here. Pilot Peterson? Yep. Peterson on the ropes? There are rules, there are instructions and procedures. And his references couldn't be worse. So don't protect him. I'm not protecting anyone. In no circumstances, even you wouldn't have landed the plane. No one would. Okay. Hold this. Start the same simulation. <sighs> Why are you kicking it? Is it yours? I don't think so. Still look like it. What idiot parked it like this? I don't know. A woman would never park a car like this. Must be one of the pilots. What was he thinking? Give me the keys. Why? We'll try to fly over it. Keys. Are you a pilot? Here. This is for you. Keys? I'm Alex. Sandra. Sandra? Can you give me a lift to the station? You need to sign the exam protocol. What are you thinking about, Mr. Pilot? Ex-pilot. Ex-pilot. I failed to test today, actually. Are you a bad student? On the contrary, I wanted to show the instructor what I'm capable of, and he failed me. You need to be smarter. What do you mean? What do you do, by the way? I don't do crazy things. The flying is crazy for you. Arguing with the instructor is crazy. Aim for your confidence. What's more important for you? Flying or your ego? What does my ego have to do with this? This is what I like about men. What do I have to do with it? Everyone is to blame but yourself. Pick up the phone, will you? Why are you saying this? You wouldn't understand. I wouldn't understand. As if only you understand everything. Who? You. Quiet. What? Please be quiet. 
Yes? What? I will. Get out of the car. Yes. This doesn't mean anything. It will all depend on your performance. You are not a pilot yet. You are a trainee. You are still on trial. You will obey my instructions and working directives. After each flight, I will make a report on how you have performed. But note, I see everything. And if something goes wrong, you're out. Clear? Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, and I'm sorry for not taking the right echelon. Make sure you have the passenger and cargo report mm -hmm. on my desk by 9 a.m. Is that clear? Yes, okay. How are you? Good. Hello. Leo, 124. 124 what? 124 airports. I'll catch up with you soon. You count well. Good job. I'll ask them to transfer you to accounting. McCoy, yep. get the paperwork. Yes, sir. They've given me a trainee again. I'd rather fly alone. Munich. as if I'm here by mistake. Where are you flying to? Amsterdam. I'm flying to Munich. Congratulations. We'll be back at the same time. This is my first flight. Celebration afterwards. Do you know the restaurant Crane? Crane. Thanks. I prefer Amsterdam. Is she a pilot too? Who? The girl you're talking to. Sandra. Are you here to work or what? My fault. Boy. Good morning, Please sir. meet our new second pilot, Trainee McCoy. Hi, girls. Hello. <laughs> oh, sorry, man. I, I didn't see you there. Yeah, I'm very hard to see. So, how about a climbing wall, Vicky? What? Let's go together. It'll be fun. Andrew, I'm having enough fun without a climbing wall. I'm Victoria. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm the head of the stewards. If you need anything, please come to me. Got it. Andrew, so where are you're you not from? a pilot. I, I don't want to be. Vicky's only nice to pilots. <laughs> <laughs> I can live with that. Always good to die. <laughs> good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. My name is Leo Fitzgerald. On behalf of the crew, I welcome you on board our plane, flying from Moscow to Munich. The flight time will be two hours and 55 minutes. I wish you a pleasant flight. Flight 117 is ready for takeoff. Flight 117, you're cleared for takeoff. Runway 19. You have the plane. Let's take off. No stunts, please. Throttle is at max. 100 knots. Check. Take off speed. Landing gear up. Gear up. We are finally home. Is everything okay? The passengers are worried. Everything is good. Sweetheart, can you get me some coffee? No sugar, please. Not 
McCoy. First military operation? This is not a military flight. It's a civil airline. And inside you have passengers, not Marines with parachutes. 200 souls that just want to get home. Is that clear? It was my fault. I pulled up too fast, but nobody died. Don't even joke like that. Now listen to me carefully. Today I will not file a report on your incorrect takeoff. But this is the first and the last time. And I will not tolerate rudeness towards members of the crew. What are you talking about? How you spoke to Andrew. He is your colleague. It was a joke. I always thought it was more of a woman's job. Up in the sky, every job is a man's job. Do you have a wife and kids? Who? Yes, uh, no. A kamikaze. You don't care about yourself, and you'll end up killing your passengers. So, McCoy, you have been warned. Can I congratulate you? Yes. These are for you. Thank you. So they got upset, turned their backs on each other, and then Sylvia from the second department comes in and says, I just saw something. What? Did you say something? No. Uh. Did you say something? No. You don't like it? I can give you a cutlet. What happened? They gave me a difficult trainee. Oh, my God. Again. A difficult trainee. You should spend more time with your son. You have a family, you know. We have a normal family. Husband works, wife works. The son is an idiot. He is not an idiot. He just doesn't see you much. I don't see you that much. Quiet. What's wrong? Quiet. What happened? Stanley, have you gone mad? Do you realize that this is the third floor? It's fine. What's fine? How many times do I have to tell you there is a door in the house? Stop climbing through the windows. What if you fall? Who will put you back together? What is this? What? Is it you? Are you getting ready for the prison? Huh? Maybe you should also start drinking. I don't drink or smoke. I'm Mr. Clean. Who? Nice of you to ask. How is your Spanish? We're getting on pretty well. Stop talking to me like that. When are your exams? They must be coming up. Don't know yet. Well, who does? I'm not going to be a Wait. lawyer. Oh, come on. Let me put you into flight school. So what, then I can become like you? Wait. Why like I... a taxi driver? What? Oh. Can I go to sleep now? Sleep, that's good idea. How can you speak to him? Can I go to sleep? Stanley, I forbid you oh, to close you the door. Try? Stanley, did you hear me? Stop pounding on it. Stop it. I hear you. I forbid you to close the door. I want to Did you hear me? If you have someone in your company who you knows Spanish well, maybe you Are you even listening to me? He needs help Do not lessons. shut the door on me. Good night, son. Ah, oh, Laura. Oh, hello, Mr. Fitzgerald. Got a minute? McCoy, wait. Listen, Laura. There's someone I know who desperately needs help in learning Spanish. You mean tutoring? Mm hmm well, I'd love to, but I don't tutor. Laura, Laura, it's important. Is he your relative? Well, it's my son, actually. The school taught the language poorly, and it didn't pass the exam. Look, he's talented in general, but idle, and you're trustworthy. Please help. Just don't give him any leniency. Will you come tonight? Mr. Fitzgerald, you know, I'm busy. I, I rarely see my husband. Thank you. Please help. Well, you know, I'd be very good. So, we're agreed. <laughs> well, let's go.
кто вам разрешил пропускать занятия по аварийно-спасательной подготовке? Если бы вы не выключили, я бы посадил. Еще бы чуть-чуть бы и Кто разрешил пропускать занятия? Vicky, what are you doing on Sunday? Andrew, if we are talking about me spending time with you, then I will be busy. Landing gear down. Flaps, landing position. Going away for another round. Landing gear up. Gear up. Flaps position one. Speed is good. Position one. Flight 117 going for another approach. Give me control. I have the plane. You have the plane. Are you crazy? Do you know what you're doing? Sorry. Weird. Leo, the whole tower's going crazy. Yeah, bad fall. Yeah, but if it wasn't for you... Yes, it could have gone wrong. Almost fired that trainee. The captain of the other plane took completely the wrong echelon. He directed his plane to the same runway you were headed. I don't know how you saw it in the fog. So what? What do you mean? A Turkish Boeing? If you didn't react as fast as you did and didn't turn around for a second approach, I can't even begin to imagine what could have happened. Hi. Hi. I must say this train A. What's going on? Studying with this new tutor. Good. Okay. Do you want something to eat? I will tell you, this train A surprised us all today. Dieci sette. Dieci sette. Dieci ocho. Dieci ocho. Dieci ocho. Dieci nueve. Dieci nueve. Puente. Puente. Puente uno. Puente uno. Puente dos. Puente uno. Just wait. Понятно. Ну, в армии вы чем проштрафились, а? Да было дело. У нас как-то поломка была. Летели же уйти, два не упали. Ну, а в трюме сотни солдат, и ни одного аэродрома вокруг. Еще летим, но сесть не можем. Рядом другие самолеты, ну, а чем тут поможешь? Чувство бессилия жуткое. Но все-таки долетели кое-как. Повезло. Ну да. И я подбил однокашника на сумасшедшую авантюру. Придумать, что делать, если такое повторится. Ну, говорит, какой-то акробат за границей. Самолета на самолет перелазил прямо в воздухе. Посчитали, с какой скоростью, на какой высоте, какие средства подручные. Идеи, конечно, как отец говорит, завиральные, но проверить все-таки решили. Ну, тут начальство узнало. Жуткий скандал поднялся. Лавочку закрыли, приятелю выговор. Ну, а меня тут же из армии выбирали. Не повезло. Со мной всегда так. До сих пор не понимаю, как надо, как не надо. Знаешь, что по башке получу, нет? Все равно лезу. И Зинченко тоже чувствую себя каким-то, не знаю, второгодником. Ну, это неправильная позиция. Хотя, конечно, мир не для хороших людей. А вы, по-моему, хороший. Да ты хорошая. Только не знаю, как тебе подобраться. Ты же сразу норовишь бах. Я не поняла, вы про кого меня расспросить хотели? Леонид Александрович. 
Привет, Леночка. Леонид Савич, я вам кое-что хотел сказать. Что, студент мой обижает? Нет, дело совсем другом. Подождите, пожалуйста. Жду, жду. Да он парень добрый. Ты не тушусь, а? И пожестче с ним. Хорошо? Ты расцвела в последнее время. Молодец. Your coffee. Thank you. Strong. Thank you. Black, no sugar. Vicky, get back inside the plane. Andrew, does our second pilot seem a bit strange today? Vicky, get inside the plane, please. Go inside. Going on here. This is a revolution, Vicky. How long will they keep us here? Quiet. This is the tower. They're checking all the passengers. They'll only allow foreigners to leave. The locals will remain here. Why? Such are the rules. <laughs> Proceed. Just be careful out there. Don't panic, please. Okay. Okay, where is your husband? Sit down, please. What happens to the others? We can't take them. Why not? Read out the control card. Wait, let's try to do something. Sir, we can contact the consulate. Read it out. These are foreign citizens. We are not allowed to interfere. This is their business. Are rubbish. Alex. Where's your corkscrew? Look. People die, but we still have to follow the rules. Yes. This is exactly what a girl wants to hear. Sandra, what's that have to do with it? Do you know what happened? What? We were in Africa. There were refugees. We could have taken them on board. I know about it. We weren't it. allowed. 
So why are you acting like this? I'm just interested. Why do all men start crying in difficult situations? Why didn't you just stop the plane? What was the problem? Sandra, let's not get into it. What? You're so brave, but only in the kitchen, huh? Are you crazy? Don't yell at me. Sandra, no one is yelling. Don't yell at me. Do you want to fight? That's it. Not a single word more. <sighs> Hello, taxi. Sandra. Can you send a car? Number two, Roseby Road, first entrance. Passenger will be waiting downstairs. Thank you. You're not a pilot. You're just a woman behind the controls. Hello. I think that I fly a lot. I don't. I don't have you finished up. with your glasses? When are we going to take off? Thanks. Soon. You think that I fly a lot? I don't. My granddaughter organised it. Oh, that's wonderful. I don't fly a lot. Have a lovely flight. Can I get a pillow? Sir. Thank you. Would you like anything? No. Oh. Finally. Flight 117, all passengers are on board. We are ready to take off. Sir, your seats are here, please. Go on, there. Fasten your seatbelt and have a good flight. Excuse me, can I have some cognac? We can't serve it now as we're about to leave. I'll bring it as soon as we take off. Do you know who this is? Do you read the papers? Do you watch TV? Oh, don't play around. One minute. Sir, that passenger is demanding cognac. Well, give it to him. Let him choke. Trim up. At 30%. Controls. Check. Well, th yeah, thank you. We tried. Your cognac? Oh, good. Please put out your cigarette. It's prohibited to smoke on board during the flight. What will you do? Make me get out? Please put out your cigarette. You are violating rules on board. What rules? What do hey, you say? Relax, sit down. Get out of here. Sit down, please. Don't touch him. Sir, we have an emergency. They've hit Angie. It, it's fine, Don't believe me. Don't interfere. It's fine, believe me. Fine, Don't call me. Stay in your seat. The pilot is not allowed to leave the cabin. One second. It might be provocation, or they could be taking the plane. J.D. McCoy. Please put out your cigarette. Who the heck are you? I'm the second pilot. We. His worship. So go and fly. Mind your own business. And pay attention. What the hell? Oh, oh, sit down. You oh. Yes, now. This is flight 117. We have an emergency. Coming back to the terminal. Сюда с эскортом, отсюда с эскортом. Лафа у них, да? Стажер Гущин, у вас есть инструкция доставить пассажиров из точки А в точку Б. Я приказывал вам оставаться на месте и не покидать кабину. Вы слышали мой приказ? Да уйдите вы с кофе! Вот мне интересно, вот если бы он простой пассажир был, тоже бы рейс задержали? Тоже коньячку налили по первому требованию, да? Вы соображаете, что говорите? А вы? Соображать, что делаете? Так, все, выгнать вас к чертовой матери. Выгоняйте. Что? Выгоняйте. Так я и знал. Но не получается у меня, как у людей. Это нельзя, то нельзя. Вон, ему все можно. Он с мигалкой. А ты как хотел? Среди людей живешь. Надо иногда и потерпеть, и уступить. Ты когда-то уступал. Вот потому и хлебаю. А -а -а. Без толку с тобой разговаривать. Только рушить умеете, а строить ни хрена. Авиапромышленность к черту. Летаем на чужих самолетах. Страну разворовали. Пап, ты че, яд какую страну разворовал? А -а -а. Пап, прости, если я тебя расстроил. 
Я же всегда на тебя смотрел. Я и в летчики-то пошел, потому что, как ты хотел. Он, когда тебя за рубеж позвали, главным конструктором, а ты не поехал. Меня прям как осенило, что ты, я не знаю, патриот, что ли. Да какой я патриот? Патриотизм это никогда бла-бла-бла-бла-бла. И никогда пьяный в фонтане флагом машешь. А когда у тебя старики в стране не побираются, патриот он. Питаешь в лаках со своими завиральными идеями. Там не получилось. Здесь не устроился ни бабы, ни неба, ни судьбы. У тебя это как будто все есть. Пошел вон. Well, I have to say, this trainee was a disaster. What? Is he studying? Wei Wei? Yes. Wednesday. Dolce. Come on, you can do more. I can't do any more. I told you he's been a little devil. I knew he was up to something. Can you see he's mad? The door should have been locked. You said it yourself. Don't lock the door. Get away from the bar. Do you know what you're doing? Do you realize he has a husband in my team? Do you know how this is going to make me what look? What kind of husband is he? He's never at home, like you. What? What are you thinking? What does he think? What did you tell him? Nothing. Darling. Uh, said nothing. Саша. Здравствуйте. Прости меня, пожалуйста. Все в порядке. Не волнуйся. Послушай. Я забираю документы, все равно выгонят. Сочувствую. Мы можем нормально поговорить. О чем? О нас. Мне плохо без тебя. Очень плохо. Понимаешь? Плохо без тебя. Прости, у меня рейс. Саша. Леша. Я все понимаю. Честное слово, ты хороший. Просто, наверное, я взрослее. Commander or what? How did you let this kid out of the cabin? The video's all over the internet. A fight on an airplane. I'm just back from headquarters. There is a big attack on our airline. We might not make it. I need to fire you. Well, fire me. What?
Can you repeat that? I will not say that I am sorry. In fact, I envy this kid. I was taught to stay quiet, to keep my mouth shut. Whatever the problem, put up with it. It says no here and underlined here. We are afraid of everything. We hide behind the You think you're the only we one? We don't even know who Every made the Every day up. my day is the same, and I live with it. And he what? doesn't because he is the right man. First, you need to teach him some manners. He has to behave himself and respect authority. One of our planes is being charted privately. It flies today. We change the crew. You are the pilot. The job is for a month, minimum. It'll give us some breathing space. You will need to take two experienced second pilots. You may choose them as you like. And we are firing this kid. That's it. No, we're not. Come again? We're not firing him. Is he your son or something? No, he's not. He's a great pilot. We have hands, you and me. He has wings. He does things in the air that I'm not capable of. So thank you, but I'm not flying without him. <laughs> Ты чего на звонки не отвечаешь? И кто разрешил забрать документы? А вам-то что? Осторожно. Двери закрываются. Леонид Савич. Леонид Савич, чего вы добиваетесь от меня? Все, я не вернусь. Хватит! Пойдем! Больше летать это ваше личное дело. Можете идти на все четыре uh -huh. стороны. Но один полет вы все-таки сделаете, так как за вас поручился один придурок. Готовьтесь к рейсу. Какой придурок? Нашелся один. На свою голову. It will take them when he returns. I want to spend more time with him. It will be good for the both of us. You can't do that. What if there's a fire or something? I left half of his things at home. I forgot to pack his socks. I will buy everything there. Okay, but don't forget to. Why are you so dressed up? What? Why so dressed up? Me? Why? I always go to work like this. Always? Every day. Why? Get down from there. Did you hear what I said? What's the point of taking him away for a month? He needs to study. I could keep an eye on him. Bye. This is nonsense. Stanley, stop. <laughs> Behave yourself. Son, a kiss. Okay, let's say goodbye. Bye. And darling, don't forget to return your security pass. Socks. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Bye. McCoy, please meet our second pilot. We fly together for the next four weeks. Sir, we will talk later. First shift, Coleman. McCoy, you're next. Let's prepare for takeoff. Hello. Hello. Can I stay here? You can't stay in the cockpit. Go inside the cabin. Take the bag. Carefully. And flight attendants are off limits. Okay. Captain? Yes. Did you request me on purpose? Yes. They say you have a light hand. 
Sandra, prepare for takeoff. Don't gain weight because you're constantly stressed. Mm -hmm. You fly all the time, you're constantly burning calories. Because you were sitting, walking. I'm being serious with you. If you lived at home now, it'd be a different matter, you know? Yeah, yeah. Seriously. I see. Alex. Alex. Captain's calling you. Do you know Kamwu? It's a volcanic island to the north of here. They just reported an earthquake, and there is a possibility of aftershocks. They're asking for help to evacuate the wounded. We are the closest to it, and we have no passengers. The airline is saying it's at our own discretion. Let's go. This is 117, changing course to Kanwu. Flight 117, we will not be able to get you permission. You will. Let me take the pilot seat. Negative. The airport there is on a rock. The approach is incredibly difficult. So? Sandra is a more experienced pilot. Shots. Get off me. Captain. Hello. 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 Good that you made it. Very good. You will take our specialists, women and children. There are some wounded. Buses will arrive with people any moment now. You need to take everyone. Everyone. Will the locals fly too? There are no locals here. Only people that come to work here on the factories. Where are you going, David? Is this a Russian plane? Yeah. Will you take uh -huh. us? Sure, we'll when? take you. When? We need to refuel and then we'll fly. I don't have a passport. Now we'll take you without a passport. Can we fly? Will you, will you take the bodies as well? What bodies? The dead. Uh, there's a lot of them. An awful lot. Let's deal with the ones that are alive first. What's the forecast? I, re I don't know. I really don't know. Well, who does know? Listen to me. The volcano is the problem. We have to fly out of here now. Can't you see? Look, calm down. The buses will arrive, and then you can fly. They'll be here soon. Well, where are they? Do you know anything? Stop. Don't shout at him. He's in shock. His wife just died. Peter, I have to do it. He's to calm you down. I'm going to the tower. Come back quickly. Sandra, go to the medics. Find out what's happening there. Yes, sir. Come here, 
I'm begging you. My husband hurt his back. We, we must fly. Can you help get him on the plane? He can't sit or stand. We have a small target. We must get him on board. I was thinking to get out of... No, don't. I've been here for hours. One plane left, another plane left. And yet, look at me. I'm still here. Okay, Danny, I'll be right back. Mais on ne peut pas rester ici. pas, regarde, je suis avec toi. Respire, tout va bien, tout ira bien.
Charlie for Cheryl, come here, help me! Calm down, calm Don't down! Don't leave the plane! Take the plane. Don't worry! Fine. Calm down! Stay calm! Get to the plane! And stay here. After a few minutes, we will try and leave. We need permission before takeoff. If you stay here and you stay calm, you will be safe. Please don't panic. What? What happened? Alex, have you seen Stanley? Where is Stanley? Why does he get to go and not be? Now hold on, Stanley. Come here. What did I tell you? Do not move from this spot. Okay, we're getting out of here. You can't. The main runway is damaged. There's a crack in it and a section is missing. We can't take off. We need to call for help, but it will be morning before we hear anything. What's over there? Behind the water tower? Over there, there's another runway. But it's completely engulfed in flames. Can you see the main fuel tanks are there? They're on fire. They could explode. Well, once the fire's burnt out, we could try to use it, but a plane that heavy can't take off on a runway that short. It won't get enough speed. It's impossible. Ah, here are the buses. Here, here, over here. Stanley. Over here. Sir, this don't way. worry. Here. Step away from the plane. You'll be able to take everyone. Please don't panic. Step away from the plane. Maybe we try to extinguish the fire on the second runway. We could try to use the water tower. What's the point? There's not enough runway. We'll end up in the sea. So what do we do? I don't know yet. Where do what? We go? Where what are we you go? talking about? Uh, tell me. Uh, tell me, please. Uh, Where? That? Where do I have to go? Go that way. Tell me something. Run to the plane. Go back to the plane. But it's your responsibility. Who is in charge here? Are you in charge? No. Where is the captain? There he is. Captain, sir, stop. My name is Marguerite. We must drive back. My sister James, and kids are there. There are, so, there are more people there. Where are they? One more bus is still in the mountains. I told her to come with me, but she's just so stubborn. I told her to come with me. She Calm has down. some kids. I'm, she's just an idiot. Captain, when can we start boarding? Wait, we can't do it yet. I don't know what to do with them. I'm asking the drivers to go back, but they won't. There's been a landslide. Can we take this minibus? Well, we can try, but there's about 30 people there. They won't all fit into one vehicle. What should we do? I'm going. No, you're not. Sir, we can't fly yet anyway. I'll be quick. You're a pilot. Your job is the plane. Stay here. And leave them like we did in Africa? Let's go. Let's leave them here. What are we here for anyway? I'll be quick. Wait, I'll show you the way. I got it. Stay here. Stay safe. They'll manage without you. This is not a job for a child. I'm not seven, if you haven't noticed. Captain! Ah. Captain! Allow me to go with him. He won't be able to take everyone. Andrew, please watch my kid. Okay. Above the factory. What's going on? Is Don't worry, it'll be fine. What's going on? As long as there are no more quakes. What is it? What's going on? Well, it must be fine because the lights are back on. Tell us what to do. Please. 
The runway is damaged. All flights are cancelled. Calm down. 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 I can't leave my sister's here. Oh, wait, wait, what's going on? Calm down. I'm still trying to get hold of my sister. Helen, where is John? He walked to that plane, Sean. How, Helen? Do you know how? It's going to take off. I don't know. How? Should be. Where are the pilots? Dead. All dead. The whole crew. That's a short takeoff distance. There's a chance that we could make it. What if we can't? don't have a choice. We need to get out of here. You're not going to put these passengers in the cargo bay, are you? I am. Ready the passengers. We're waiting for the buses. And then we take off. We need to go 
Go back! Go back where? The airport's ahead of us! Quiet! Where's the driver? There's nothing there. They're not coming back. If we're not in the air in five minutes, there won't be a runway. There'll be nothing left. Everyone, get on board. Go. Go, 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 go. Go on. That's it. To the plane. Go. Is the plane refueled? If they're alive, McCoy will make it. Go inside the plane.
What are we gonna do? So what are you gonna do now? We're gonna burn alive here! Who's the captain? Are you the captain? Yes! What are we gonna do? We'll figure this out. We're asking you! How are we gonna take off? We'll take off using the second runway at the end of the field. Get on board! Hurry up! And let everyone on! Okay, let's go up the stairs. Everything will be fine. Remain calm, please. Watch your step. Please hurry. Up the stairs. Quick. Let's go. Come on. Let the kid through. Let's go up the stairs, please. Everything's gonna be okay. There you go, watch your step. Please board the plane. Let's sit down. That's my mom! Don't worry, she's on the other plane. Please sit up. Please sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Stop, Captain. What's the delay? There's burning fuel on the runway. Uh, so what do we do? Do you see that tower? There's water in there. The fire. We'll push the tower and it will collapse and put out fuel on the runway. We'll have a few seconds to take off. And what if it doesn't collapse? Enough. We'll discuss that after we land. Go back to the cabin. They need you then.
Engine. Everything's under control. Keep the passengers calm. How? Gently. You're the man for the job. The plane is going through volcanic ash. There's fire in the engine. Because... How soon will they clear the ash cloud? We don't know. There's a possibility of fire in the second engine. Is there a landing strip nearby? What landing strip? There's only ocean. But the engine's not working. Fire in the second engine. Decreasing speed. Trying to put out the flames. Sir, please close the blinds. Thanks for coming. Who is the pilot? A trainee. We recently hired him. Clear of the ash cloud. <sighs> Eyes out. Stanley. Go to the cabin, see what's going on there. Excuse me. Are you going to serve food? <gasps> you know, there's hungry people here. There's a strong vibration in the engines. They're clogged with ash, and there is a problem with the landing gear. Ready the nearest airport. Peter, we need to ready the nearest airport. They won't manage to fly further. Ready the nearest airport. That is their only chance. New information. Switch to second channel. The fuel tank was damaged during takeoff. It's leaking. I'm losing fuel. It's not enough to fly to the mainland. I repeat, fuel tank. Captain Fitzgerald. Is, is that you, sir? Trainee. Trainee McCoy. McCoy, you're alive. Yes. How are you? Are you okay? How's Sandra? She is fine. Where's Stanley? Here, put these on. Put them on. Stanley, can you hear me? Can you hear me? I would never have abandoned you. Stanley. Stanley. Can you hear me? Sir, sorry, it's me. I got it, trainee. Alive. Grow up. Are you five years old? He waited for us till the very end. He refueled our plane. Stop whining. We're losing fuel. Here's the plan. I'll try and land on water. You will call the ships and pick up everyone that survives. 
They don't have other options. You could have the whole Navy out there. But landing a cargo plane on water in such conditions is suicide. Leo, how much fuel do you have left? I have about 20 minutes, if I'm lucky. Can you make it to land? So, what procedures do we have for this? There are no procedures for this. I... I once saw on TV... There was this guy that climbed... from one plane... to another... in mid-air. Sir, I have, I have an idea, as one of my relatives says, a crazy idea. Crazy? That's something we need right now. We drop to a minimum altitude, to 10,000 feet. Is it possible? Yes. Can you hold a minimum speed of 350 knots, no more? Yes. Pressure will be close to normal. I'll open the door. I'll come in from your tail. And you will open the cargo bay. And we will... And we will transfer the passengers on a wire to my plane. Is it possible at all? Theoretically, yes. But... No one has ever tried it. It's suicide. We need to call the emergency services. Maybe they have something to recommend. This is real life, not a circus. There's too many people. Don't you understand? They don't have a choice. The planes will collide. The wind's too strong. They won't be able to stay stable. 117, I'm not allowing you to risk it. You'll have one engine. You'll be lucky to land your own plane. I prohibit it. You'll be locked up if you don't comply. We need to land first. Stanley, we're not a military flight with parachutes for everyone. We have 200 souls. About 200. Attention, please. This is pilot Alex McCoy. Our plane is on its way to the mainland. Soon you will all be safe. But there is another plane near us. It's damaged and has people on board. They won't make it if we don't help them. We'll need to take a risk and try to transfer them to our plane. I can't make this decision on my own. I need your support. Unanimously. All those in favor? Why are you still sitting there? Go, count. We can't risk it. Six of the instructions. How will we look each other in the eye after this? Well, that's easy for you to say. You've never been in their situation. Are you sure? And who will answer for this? Let's not interfere, then.
it is. Keep calm. I see it. Okay, guys. You two go and get ready. Open the door. Just be careful there. Standing? Huh? I need you to work together, all right? I'm gonna go and help. Can I come with you? No, you're in charge here. Is my mum on that plane? Fasten your seatbelt. Push! Uh, together! Push! Push! Uh, go on, then. Here we go. One uh, more time. Uh, Push! Uh, one more time. Everyone together now. Everyone together. Again. Now. Push! It won't open. Can't open it. I'm sorry. Sorry. Alex, listen to me. Is that you? It's me. Who else could it be? Who else? Listen carefully. I have an idea. What idea? As always, a crazy idea. Lift the floor in the compartment. The instructions say we can't go in there while the plane is in the air. There's avionics and navigation systems there. I wrote those instructions, but those were for normal situations. And you are far from normal there. Lift that floor in the compartment. Try opening the cargo hatch. It opens out, so it should work. And if it doesn't work, just kick it out. It's all there. You can lift the passengers through that hatch. I don't know if it'll work. We'll make it work. Hold the lower echelon and hold the distance. Got it? Got it. Get down and hold on! Hey. Hold on! Kick it on free! Hey! Dad. Thank you. Three! Mom, Mom, what's going on? Sit, sit down, sit down. Okay, it's okay, we're gonna get you safe. Attention, passengers. My name is Sandra Coleman, I am your second pilot. We will now board the second plane in the air. Check your bags and cases. Put on any warm clothes that you have. If you have creams or gels, put them on your faces and hands. If we panic, we will all die. Everything will be fine, don't if worry. If we stay calm, Please stay we will live. Like this. I will give you my daughter's phone number. Please. Can you make sure that you call her for me? Will you? Please. Come on. Really don't panic. To me that you... you will call her yourself. I'm not getting in there. I'm staying. Sorry. Her name is Sophie. Please, I haven't seen her in seven My years. My sister was on that bus with her two children. With two kids. I told her to go with me. But she wouldn't listen. We argued. I see. And the last words I told her was that she was an idiot. I hate myself for that. Oh, I said when the lines roll. Yeah. We're opening the hatch. Move back.
I need to get even closer to the cable. I'm gonna have to turn the plane. Use the rudder, but carefully. Got it. Using the rudder. Safely. Here. Please, take this. Please, thank you. Keep it. Here, here, take my coat. Take mine. is on the limit. Losing altitude. Stay there! Don't 
Are you injured? Injured? Hold them. <laughs> directly into a storm. Can you do this any faster? Captain, we're sending the last party. Go with them. No, I won't leave you. Go, I said. Quickly. Go, please go. Vicky, hold on. Hold on. Quick, Sandra, get on. Go, get on. Hold on tight. Hold on. The basket's broken! The 
use this rope. Here. Tie it on. We'll go together. Clean? Almost. Andrew? Uh, uh, don't worry, I'm okay. Uh, uh. He said that Mum was on the other plane. I'm trying to help you. Uh huh. Go to the compartment, I'll help you. Come on, get up. It's okay. Go, thank you. Captain, I wanted to say that. I was a bit harsh back there on the island. A bit? of Flight 117, Leo Fitzgerald. The crew and the passengers are on board. Leo, take control. Second pilot McCoy will fly the plane. Okay. 117, we're planning to land you at the nearest airport, but we received a storm warning. It's now closed. There's a storm there and the clouds are very low. The wind is very strong. Can you make it to the other airport? Our engine's at its limits. It's full of ash. The second engine is out. We won't get through the storm. We'll be landing at the nearest airport. Prepare the runway. Sandra, leave us for a minute. Get out! She's more experienced. I didn't train for this. Neither did I, and nor did she. Sir! I'm scared. 
There are so many people on board. I try not to think about it, but I can't help it. I've already done everything I can. I can't do it. My hands are shaking. I'm very scared. I'm scared too. Even more scared than you are. You at least can hold the controls. I can't do that. This plane is extremely reliable. Others would have fallen apart in such conditions. Like in the simulator. Remember? It's almost the same now. You can do it. Maintain balance until the end, when you touch down. Decrease speed until the wing touches the ground. It'll get ripped off! That's it. We'll discuss this when we've landed. 117, I'm diverting you to Petropavlovsk. Good luck. Well, it's with God now. Vicky, time to make the announcement. Try to stay calm. I can do it if you want me to. Yeah, I'll do it. A attention passengers. We are getting ready for landing. Please follow our instructions. Store your trays away. Stay calm. What follow are you doing? Our instructions. Oh, 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 oh. Please, oh, oh, please. Oh, oh, please. Oh, oh, oh. You are the overhead You must sit, please. And make sure that all luggage is underneath you. Gentlemen. Don't be afraid. It's scarier under mines. Return your headrest the upright position and make sure that all luggage the lights have gone out we're coming in get ready for emergency landing flashlight i need a flashlight put the headrest up please Hear me? Let's play. When we touch down, hold your arms and legs like this. Got it? No, no, I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave my sister. Secure the overhead lockers and make sure that all luggage is underneath you. Listen, it's, it's okay. Please help us. It's all okay. Stay calm. It's okay. Sit down. Stay calm. It, it's fine. Sit down. Deploy it, Pats. Pats, position three. Speed check. Position three. Hold the place steady. Control tower. Get fire tracks and ambulances to the runway. I can't see the runway. I can't see it. Use the navigator.
Reverse thrust engaged. Hold steady until the wing touches down. Hold it! Hold it! Hold the plate! Hold it! Not the softest landing. Not the softest. You passed. Did you land? Tell me, did you land? What about the passengers? We landed. about me spending time with you, then I'm free. <sighs> Alex? One moment, Sandra, one moment.
didn't you wake me up? What's happened? Everything's okay. What's with the hand? It's fine. Together. Беспримерное мужество и героизм, проявленные при спасении российских и иностранных граждан в зоне бедствия, а также мастерство, с которым была произведена посадка аварийного судна, не являются достаточными основаниями для того, чтобы пилот Леонид Зинченко и пилот-стажер Алексей Гущин продолжали работу в нашей авиакомпании. Ввиду грубейшего нарушения инструкций и выпиющего отношения к отдельным пассажирам. От лица руководства авиакомпании я приношу извинения. Ну, все правильно. Так вы говорите, этот ваш Зинченко хороший летчик? Ну тогда, может, в порядке исключения строгий выговор и оставить? М? Впрочем, решайте сами. Желаю дальнейшего процветания. На благо Отечества. Подожди-ка. Да, Исаевич, да не надо, не унижайте. Подожди. Подожди. Минуточку! Ну что? Извиниться хочу. Стыдно. Стыдно. Стыдно, что он, а не я вам по физиономии съездил. Я услышал. Пришлось извиняться за тебя, Непутёва. Но нас услышали. Угу. Соедини меня с аэрофлотом. Товарищ большой начальник лучшей авиакомпании страны. Здорово, здорово. Слушай-ка. Ты там летчиков себе не набираешь? Есть у меня тут два кандидата. Как говорит один мой хороший знакомый, вместо рук у них крылья. Пилот Джонстон. Пилот Крокер. Пилот Шеффорд. Пилот Мартин. Пилот Колман. Пилот Колман. О, Пилот Маккой. Здесь. Трейни Маккой. Trainee Fitzgerald. I'm here. To the ropes. Trainee Fitzgerald. Now I'll be in Paris. Go on, get up there. Trainee Fitzgerald, come on. Trainee McCoy. Mm. Catching up 